Hello everybody. I'm back again here to do another video. Now the last video I filmed, even though it's no longer up on YouTube, was my rant on entertainment. And then, uh, but the last video I posted was was my game first game of Deal or No Deal Special Edition for the Wii, which was filmed back in February. But anyway, I'm here to do another video, and this video is going to be a 2013 edition of my Legend of Zelda collection. Let's get to it. I'm going to show these in order here, or at least what I'd say is in order. There. So, uh, here we go. First one up is the original Legend of Zelda, which I had not beaten, but I had made it pretty far, thanks to the Zelda Dungeon dot, dot net on their in and their YouTube account. But I mean Zelda fans have this game to thank for starting for starting this series. And this is pretty good. Next up, The Adventure of Link, Zelda 2. Which, this one I did beat. Uh, and it was pretty difficult, I gotta say. But, I beat it. This game's pretty good, by the, by the way. I think it was... No, it wasn't the first uh, Zelda game I ever bought. But, oh well. But I do recommend you check this out. Next up, Zelda A Link to the Past for the Super Nintendo. I have not beaten this game yet, but I gotta say, this is probably... Uh, the easiest Zelda game to me because of the mainly because of a better map, and some people consider this to be their favorite. I can see why. I do recommend you check this game out, though. It's really good. Now onto the N sixty four stuff. For Zelda games, and the uh, first game I'm going to show for the N64 that I have for Zelda is the Ocarina of Time. This came out in, uh, I think, in November of 1998, I think, or something. And this is the Collector's Edition. And this game I also beat, by the way. The Zelda 2 and this game are the only Zelda games I've beaten so far, but. I'll probably be some other, some other Zelda games. But this game is another one that's set, that is praised by so many Zelda fans. Next one I have is the collector's edition of Majora's Mask. This game's got only four dungeons, whereas I think, <coughs> excuse me, whereas I think uh, Zelda Ocarina of Time I think has seven or eight or something. But this game mostly focuses on side quests, which I don't really do. But if that's what you're really into, this is the, this is the game for you. I just go through the main game though. Now on to the GameCube stuff. Can't this one doesn't have a cover for it, but this is the Legend of Zelda the Wind Waker. And uh there's the disc. 
I don't know if I'm showing this right. There. But yeah, that, that's what this game is. This is Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. Got this as a birthday present earlier this year, I think it was. From Rodney1279, so... And thanks for the present, by the way, Rodney. Next up, Legend of Zelda Collector's Edition. This game's got four, five, technically, well, four full games and one uh, demo. The game, the four, the four games it has are The Legend of Zelda, Zelda 2: The Adventure of Link, Ocarina of Time, and Majora's Mask. And the demo is the The Wind Waker. I think this game you can only get if you got if you got like, bought like a GameCube back in 2003. So, I guess this is kind of a rarity, actually. Last thing for the GameCubes, which I don't, haven't really played. This one I haven't really played all that much. But it's Four Swords Adventures, which is the uh, sequel to Four Swords on the Game Boy Advance. Which, that one was bumped in with the remake of A Link to the Past. And the disc is not in the case. It's probably uh, in the... Uh, the... I mean, Go out and get it. <clears throat> the disc's probably in uh, this thing here. I'll look at it later, though. But <clears throat> I, I guess the uh, excuse me. I guess this game here is okay, even though I haven't played it. Excuse me. Next up is Twilight Princess for the Wii, the Nintendo Selects version. Um, I want to like this game, but I don't know if I can, because uh, there's one part I get stuck at, I'm stuck at, and that's the one where you have to get the, the fish to the cat to get it into a... Uh, to get that shop, to get into that shop to buy the slingshot, I think it is. I'm stuck on that. Maybe, I, maybe I'd get past that though if I had the GameCube version. But, oh, but this game, I guess, other than that, is okay. But it's, it's just that it's a difficult part. Next up. Ocarina of Time 3D, the remake of o Ocarina of Time, originally on the N64. <coughs> Excuse me. I like this game. Some people say this is the best 3DS game there ever was. I can see why. Last Zelda game I have is uh, Skyward Sword, which I like this game. I know some people don't like like it. I don't believe the haters because this is really good. The motion controls are really good in this game too. And this and this copy uh, came with this. Zelda 25th Anniversary Disc. It's, uh, here it is, right here. Or, wait. Uh, there, that's it. But, yeah. Oh, and I also forgot to mention that Zelda looks really cute in this game, I gotta say. As she does in Twilight Princess. I forgot to say that. <laughs> but anyway, that's my Zelda Legend of Zelda collection video, 2013 edition. See y'all for the next video.